Hello everyone and welcome to Test Driven Development in iOS using Swift. I will be on instructor Mohammad Azam. I'm super excited that you have decided to take this course. Testing is just such an integral part of application development. Well-written tests will give you confidence to make future changes. This is a very, very pragmatic course and it covers the practical aspects of test-driven development. Let's go ahead and check out the contents of this course. You will start by learning about the three W's. What is TDD? Why use TDD? And when to use test-driven development. Next, you will learn about different types of testing. This will include unit test, user interface test, performance test, acceptance test, as well as integration test in your application. After that, you will start writing your first unit test. You will learn how to write descriptive name for your test and what exactly needs to be tested in your application. Next, you will learn how to write UI tests using the libraries provided by the XC test framework. You will also learn how to automate your UI test and write test for your existing application using the page object pattern. After that, you will learn about code coverage and how it helps you to find out what portion and percentage of your code is covered under test. You will learn how to write small app and compute code coverage based on the tools available in Xcode. Next, you will learn about mocking in test. You will implement a mocked web service which will be injected through your test into your main application. Mocking will allow your test to run independently without having any dependencies. You will also learn how to write integration tests to test a complete story associated with your project. You will also learn how to use the Springboard to delete your app from the device before running each test. Next, you will work on a quiz app which will allow you to put all your skills to test. You will learn how to architect the application using the principles of domain-driven design and write tests to make sure your core domain works as expected. So if you're excited, let's go ahead and get started.